This is not hype. This is not clickbait. This is genuinely the strongest hairless solution I've ever seen available on the market. And in this video, I'm going to prove it to you. You know how people sometimes sit around and just have some fun and say, oh, what would happen if we combined Ali and Tyson into one boxer? I mean, that would be incredible. Or if we combine the engine of a Ferrari with a Lamborghini, my God, that's going to do, you know, not to 60 in about a second. Those kind of fantastical ideas. Now, apply that to hair loss and this is it. This is what would happen if people sat, sat around a table and just fantasized about coming up with the strongest hair loss solution imaginable. This is combining the Lamborghini with a Ferrari. Bonkers. So this is the solution I'm talking about. It's Dutastride in solution form combined with minoxidil in solution form. Now, for the real connoisseurs of the, you know, in the hairless industry, they'll understand the significance of this in an instant. But for everyone else, let's go back a little bit and just um, quickly go over what this treatment is all about, why is it exciting, and why I think this is probably the biggest breakthrough I've seen in the hair loss you know, product industry for many, many years. So as I said, this is, I think this is the most powerful hair loss solution. And no, it's not at least three years away. This one is actually here right now. Let's get into it. But before we begin, an obvious disclaimer, do not try any product mentioned in this video without consulting your physician first. This video is not intended as medical advice, only for education. Let's start by having a look at Finastride, which is the traditional kind of building block of hair loss treatments for men. Okay, so let's, let's double back a little bit and talk about the common drugs that are on the market for hair loss up until today. The main one, Finastride or Propecia, most of you will know about this, and it works by blocking this enzyme that destroys hair follicles. The enzyme is called 5-alpha reductase. You might have heard of it, bit of a mouthful, and it's very active in balding men. So there are two types of this enzyme, type one and type two. The problem is that finasteride only blocks the type two. So the type one is doesn't touch it. Therefore, finasteride is only up to 70% effective. Now, let's look at how finasteride compares to dutastride because to understand the power of this product, you have to understand all the different levels. The next common drug for hair loss that has been around for decades is dutastride and it works on exactly the same enzyme as finasteride, but there are major differences. This one works on both types of that enzyme. Remember that enzyme 5-alpha reductase has got a type 1 and a type 2. This works on both, on both types. So this one is up to 90% effective. Remember finasteride is only up to 70% effective. And both of them, they work by reducing... When you block this enzyme, you reduce the amount of DHT, which is the hormone that miniaturizes hair follicles. But there's a price to pay for the effectiveness of dutastride, it has much, much nastier and more frequent side effects. This applies only when taken orally, okay? And by the way, both dutastride and finasteride have medical um, indications, so older men take them for prostate issues and all that, okay? So what do you do? This drug, Dutastride is very, very effective, up to 90% effective, but you can't touch it because of the nasty side effects. This is how most people saw this drug up until now. Now, let's talk about side effects because this is the key. This is why I am making this video. You need to understand the difference between the side effect profile of finasteride and Dutastride. Let's go. Now let's talk about some of the common side effects for both drugs. And when we say common, statistically we mean side effects that happen or that can happen in about 1 in 10 of the people who take any particular drug. 
So there's common, there's very common, there's uncommon, there's rare, there's very rare, there's different. And this only applies when taken orally, okay? So with both drugs, with finasteride and dutasteride, there are, you know, erectile issues, the bishop might, might not wake up, reduced libido, might not be in the mood as much, something called gynecomastia, I think I butchered the spelling of that, um, apologies. Gynecomastia is basically man boobs, uh, growing man boobs, uh, and mood issues. So it can lower mood and cause, you know, depression and anxiety, that kind of thing. So not 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 a pleasant set of side effects. Okay, but these are much worse with dutasteride because dutasteride, remember. It blocks both types of the enzyme. So you it makes sense that the side effects are much worse with the to test right, which is another reason people are really hesitant about using this orally. Okay? So up until now, you know, we we when I say we, I mean the kind of medical community in general usually never recommended taking to test right for hair loss. It's just it's just too much. It's for the for the ninety percent effectiveness, you are paying a very heavy price, most likely with side effects. So generally, I personally never recommended it for hair loss taken orally. <clears throat> and most people are stuck with finasteride, especially finasteride comes in liquid form, and liquid forms have much lower side effects. And unfortunately, up until now, there's never been a liquid form, a reliable liquid form of dutasteride. So only a few brave souls took the oral dutasteride, people who were just desperate for hair, who were willing to just live with the side effects, but most people just stuck with the either the finasteride in liquid form or minoxidil or something else. So it was very clear that we needed a reliable liquid form of dutasteride. For monster hair growing power, because this thing is up to 90% effective, it's like a sledgehammer, minus the side effects. Because when you have something in liquid form, it just stays in the area you apply it. It doesn't usually get absorbed that much, so the side effects are way, way less. And after decades of waiting, the wait is over. So you see, we've been frustrated for decades because we have this incredibly effective dutasteride drug for hair loss but we can't really use it because the side effects are so atrocious so the solution was well the solution was to come up with a solution it's here a liquid form of dutasteride made to the highest standard with knockout power in liquid form and made in a specialist UK lab and we know how strict UK manufacturing guidelines are so this is going to be of the highest quality and wait for it this actually also contains 10% minoxidil on top remember usually you get minoxidil in like smaller percentages this has 10% minoxidil this is why I'm calling it the sledgehammer. Oh my God, I butchered the spelling of sledgehammer as well. So up until now, this has been only been available privately. This is something I learned um, a few weeks ago, but now it's available to the general public. And we'll talk about how a little bit later. And so far, this has good efficacy and safety data from everyday use. The way I came across this was actually by accident. This product was already available and been used by, I think, a couple of private clinics in the UK, and it has shown tremendous results. And I got talking to uh, some friends that I'm working with at the moment. They mentioned it, and that's how I came across this. Otherwise, I would never have known. This is not, you're not going to see this on YouTube or uh, Facebook or Google. This is, those who know, know. Now we've got to talk about the other star of the show. The, this show has not got only one star, there's two stars, and the other star is minoxidil. Now let's talk a little bit about minoxidil, because I think we need to talk about minoxidil. 
So this is the mystery man of hair loss products. No one to this day, despite this thing being available for like coming up to 35 years, no one knows how exactly it works. And it works, it works all right. If it's available in 2% and 5%, 2% is licensed for women, 5% for men. And usually, I used to work in a kind of a, a lab that makes this custom. And usually once you get to 10 to 15%, it becomes very difficult to make because it turns into crystals. And obviously you can't use that. But this formula has cracked the code. It has 10% minoxidil with liquid detestride. Imagine 10% minoxidil, which is one of the highest strengths, plus detestride. I mean, you can imagine the power. Now let's talk about the other products because it's not just minoxidil and dutastride in 0.2%. There's also a minoxidil 10% and dutastride 0.1% that has slightly less dutastride. That would probably be um, a good a good one to start with for someone looking to break into this product range. And there's also a minoxidil with finastride, again, of the highest quality. Uh, all of them come in 60 mils. So why do I say this product is of the highest quality? Well, A, is made in the UK and I'm sorry to you people in the US and Canada no one touches the UK when it comes to quality pharmaceuticals the standards here are top top notch just to open premises to do anything you have to jump through a thousand hoops and really prove your case so on that front you can't compete with the UK secondly this is made by people who specialize in hair loss it's not made by any Tom, Dick and Harry who just formulates. These are people with an eye for hair loss products. So because of these two, I challenge anyone to find a product with similar ingredients of this quality. Anyway, so let's talk about how you can access this product. So this product is not the usual Shopify product where you click a couple of buttons and it gets shipped to you. It doesn't work like that. You have to have a consultation. You have to be prepared to do some paperwork. If you're not prepared and you're too lazy, don't even bother. And the prices, I'll put the latest prices in the description below so that you don't waste your time going to the website and all that if the price is uh, out of your budget. And the third question uh, that people might have is, can it be shipped abroad? Yes, it can be shipped abroad. Um, requires extra paperwork, but that can be sorted. So if you have any more questions about this product or if you want me to do other videos related to any of the products or ingredients mentioned in this video, just let me in the comments below. See you soon. Take care.